Making Cappuccino When preparing cappuccino, make the coffee in a large cup. Fill a container, preferably one with a handle to avoid scalding, with about 100 grams of milk for each cappuccino. In choosing the size of the container, bear in mind that the milk doubles or triples in volume. Please note, for a richer, denser froth, use skimmed or partially skimmed milk at refrigerator temperature about 5 degrees Celsius. To avoid milk with poor froth or large bubbles, always clean the cappuccino maker as described in this section, cleaning the cappuccino maker after use. During preparation, steam is given off. Take care to avoid scalds. Make sure the cappuccino hot milk ring is positioned downwards in the cappuccino position. The cappuccino maker can be turned slightly outwards to allow containers of any size to be used. Immerse the cappuccino maker in the milk container. Never immerse the black ring. Press the steam icon. Steam is displayed. After a few seconds, steam is delivered from the cappuccino maker, giving the milk a creamy, frothy appearance and making it more voluminous. For a creamier froth, rotate the container with slow movements in an upward direction. You should not deliver steam for more than three minutes at a time. When the required froth is obtained, interrupt steam delivery by pressing the steam icon. Add the milk froth to the coffee prepared previously. The cappuccino is ready. Sweeten to taste and, if desired, sprinkle the froth with a little cocoa powder. Danger of burns. Stop steam delivery before removing the container with the frothed milk to avoid burns caused by splashes of boiling milk. Please note, if energy saving is active, you may have to wait a few seconds before steam is delivered.